Hi, my name is Pam Denny. I'm an analytics architect with the IBM Maximo development team. And in today's video recording, I want to highlight one of the most heavily requested features we have when using a Cognos dashboard, and that is the ability to drill down from the dashboard into more details. So let me start by going right into a demonstration of this great feature. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly create a dashboard and highlight this feature for you. So I'm going to start with our data module that I had previously created, and I'm simply going to select Create a Dashboard. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on the intricacies of creating the dashboard. I'm just going to add a quick visualization here again so you can see this fabulous new feature. So let me come directly down here, and I'm going to add a bar chart to my dashboard. I'm going to open up my work order data set and I'm going to start to bring in information. I've actually correlated or cleaned up some of my report data or my data from Maximo. So I'm looking at the reported month and let me grab a few other features. Let me just grab my work order number and let's actually color this content by work type. So let me open this full screen here so you can see what we've actually created. So now I have a visualization where I can see my number of work orders by month, and my month is correlates to the numbers here. One would be January, 12 would be December, and then it's color coded by work type. Now imagine a user is looking at this content. Well, oftentimes what they want to know is, well, what are the corresponding work orders? Well, I can see if I hover over here that I have about 1,600 work orders with a category of CM or corrective maintenance. But again, I want to find the details here. So what I would simply do is again, highlight my chart and now select the thing over here. I call this a thing, but it's a drill down. I want to drill down to find more information. So I'll select the drill through and I'll add a new drill through. So now what I need to do is define where the drill through point is. In my case, it's a report. I have it stored over here and it's called work order list by work type. And I simply select it and then OK. Now this particular report that's shown over here on the left hand side was specifically developed with a parameter or a prompt. And my parameter in this case is work type. And that's what you need for a drill through definition. You need a report with a defined one or more parameters that you can then filter your visualization from your, from your dashboard to. So now what I need to do is select the corresponding data field in my dashboard in my visualization. So I select work type. So again, my parameter in my report is work type. The field it corresponds to in the dashboard is work type. And now I select apply. Let me save this so I don't lose this data because I'm creating this on a Tuesday. I'm just going to simply call it a Tuesday and I'll put it under that same demo folder and click save. And now let's actually show you this report as an end user might be looking at it. Again, they're interacting with the content. They want to see the additional details. Well, now when I right click on it, see again that drill through definition icon, I highlight that and it's going to pass my filter, which was SA for safety work orders. And now I can see all the corresponding work orders and asset definition and whatever else I included in my report in that drill through. So it opens up in a separate window. If I want to go back to my dashboard, I could do that. Again, if I want to drill through, highlight it, click on the drill through icon, and it's going to pass that information over to the report, which displays in a separate window. So it's very, very easy to create this really fabulous new feature to drill down. Just remember the requirements are that you need a corresponding report with a parameter that corresponds to the dashboard. So in my case, my parameter, my report was work type, and then I have the work type field and dashboard that I can pass or filter down the information to. So thank you very much for your time and for seeing this great new feature of drill through definition and Cognos dashboards.